Don't talk about it like you're crazy You know damn well I can't replace you Just say what, say what you mean Don't waste your time being mad at me Say what, say what you mean, say what you mean And you'll get, get what you need, get what you need What I do, what I do is try Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are having a great day so far. Um, in today's video, I'm gonna take you along with me as I just clean my house because uh, that's what we do here, right? Cleaning and organizing motivation. And my house just feels dirty to me. Like There's like just some places in my house that I feel like have been overlooked and I really just need to buckle down and take care of some things around the house. Life is so busy right now and I feel like I've just been letting things slide that I shouldn't let slide so I'm gonna go ahead and tackle that and also like there's so much clutter and it stresses me out really badly like it gives me anxiety just the amount of stuff that we have in our house um, and I know it's gonna be like this until after Christmas probably like my room is just overrun with boxes and but it is what it is so we're gonna tackle what we can I definitely want to clean my bathrooms today because the boys bathroom is disgusting like if you have boys you know what I'm talking about like the floor is just like it's not a good situation so I need to get that cleaned and then I also have so much laundry that needs to be folded I think I have a basket of laundry for every person in my house plus a load in the washer a load in the dryer and a basket full of laundry that is dirty still so I really need to take care of that today I need to wash Brayden's sheets um, and I also want to like, I don't know, there's other things that I want to do that I can't think of right now, but hopefully we can tackle it. I have not gotten ready today, as you can probably tell, and I'm wearing my husband's t-shirt, but it is what it is. I feel motivated to tackle it right now, so I'm not going to take the time to get ready and all of that because I will probably lose my motivation. I'm definitely one of those people that, you know, I have to do it when I feel like doing it and not wait too long or I'm just gonna make excuses to not tackle it so I'm gonna go ahead and do that um, before we get started make sure you are subscribed if you're new around here I would love to have you stick around my name is Sheila I'm a Mary stay-at-home mom to four kiddos I have a 16 year old a six year old a four year old and a five month old um, so I enjoy uploading cleaning and organizing motivation for you guys it also motivates me to tackle these things because that's why I picked up the camera today because I feel like if I film it I will definitely go through and finish what I start instead of stopping halfway through and getting distracted or you know whatever but life with a newborn is also very unpredictable so he's being good right now um, and he'll go down for his nap soon so I'm gonna take the time that I have and tackle what I can um, but let's Let's get into it before I talk too much longer. All right, so we're gonna start off in the kitchen because the kitchen is not really bad. I cleaned everything up basically last night. I just have some dishes that I need to put in the dishwasher. Go ahead and start that and wipe a few things down. I do wanna clean the floors, but I'm gonna wait to do that until the end so I can just do them all at one time. We are who we are. Why don't I be me and you be you? We're spreading color. so if you're curious as to why the changing table is currently in the kitchen in this video i had moved it out of our bedroom because we no longer need like a bedside nursery in there hunter is in his room full time for um like overnight and naps so i had moved it out here um, originally i was going to put it in the shed because it does match the crib that we got but we got our crib second hand off Facebook Marketplace as well as this changing table. So we just decided to give the changing table to someone that needed it. Um, so I just posted it on Facebook and someone came and picked it up. So it is gone now, but that's why it was there. Try to express yourself in your own way. And we could have some fun. No problems coming in our way. I would like you just the way you are. So 
really quick, I wanted to thank Love Every for sending over this play mat for Hunter. Um, I'm not sure if you're familiar with them or not, but they have play kits that are um, appropriate for different age groups. And this play mat is perfect for Hunter. And you guys, it is huge and the quality is amazing. I was so surprised when I opened it up and saw how big it was and, and he loves it. It's so good for him. There's so many different colors and things for him to pull on or squeeze to make noises. Um, there's cards that you can put in, little mirrors. It really is just an awesome play mat for little babies to explore and to help keep him occupied because he loses his interest very, very quickly, as I'm sure you guys know. So we have a lot of different things to like try to keep him occupied while I'm doing things. And this play mat is so good for that. It really is the perfect thing for a little baby his age and he can grow with it. Um, so if you're in the market for anything like this play mat or you have little kids and you're looking for like play kits for them, make sure you check out the link in my description box. Um, and thank you again to Love Every for sending over this play mat for Hunter. to my room and I'm just gonna make my bed in here and you know try to declutter some of the surfaces and mainly focus on folding my laundry and my husband's laundry in here really quickly just because it really needed to be done I hate doing laundry and I'm sure if you've been at my channel for any amount of time you know that um, folding it folding laundry is just like the bane of my existence I hate doing it but it has to be done right and someone's got to do it and that someone is me i have to do it so i'm gonna tackle all of that
So I know this video is going up shortly before Christmas, so I'm curious to know how you guys are doing right before the holidays. Um, I'm so proud of me and my husband this year because we started shopping early. Usually I'm a last minute shopper, like two weeks before you know Christmas, I'm just starting my shopping, but I have been done now with all of the presents wrapped um, for almost two weeks, I wanna say, like really, really close to two weeks. And I'm so proud of that because this time of the year is usually so, so stressful for me. Um, but this year it's not, and I'm really, really loving it. I'm really able to enjoy my time with the kids. I'm not stressed out about anything. And um, I'm really happy with what we were able to get all of the kids. Um, let me know down below if you're feeling the same way. And if you're not, I, I understand. Trust me, I'm there most years. and I'll probably be there again next year. So I'm definitely taking this this holiday season and enjoying not being stressed out. Um, but also, is anyone else's room just over overflowing with Amazon boxes? I don't know if you saw it in the beginning of this video, but by my window, it was just overflowed with Amazon boxes. And now that I have all the presents wrapped, um, most of them are under the tree, um, which is a, another question that I have for you guys. Um, do you put all of the gifts from you that aren't from Santa? Do you put those under the tree before Christmas or do you do it right at Christmas? Because this is the first year that I've actually put gifts under the tree before Christmas day, like like Christmas Eve night or whatever. Um, just because usually my kids, like I didn't think they would, they would just open them, I felt like. But this year I wrapped all of them and I did four different wrapping papers, one for each kid. And I'm gonna be putting like a piece of the wrapping paper at the bottom of their stocking so that once they open up their stocking, they'll find their piece of wrapping paper and then they'll know what gifts are theirs. So let me know if you do that, but also let me know if you're ready to have your spaces back, like your closets and all the spaces that you're hiding all of your presents at. tackling in this video that I had time to tackle is the boys bathroom because like I told you in the beginning it was disgusting like the camera does not pick up on it and I'm sorry it's so yellow right here the lighting in this bathroom is so weird sometimes but it doesn't stay like that for long um, but in here I needed to wipe down all of the cabinets clean the mirrors clean the floor right there because oh it's so gross the camera does not pick it up but boys are just gross you guys sometimes I just, it's just gross so I'm gonna go ahead and get all of that clean and clean out the bathtub as well um, and then I didn't get to the floors on this day like I really wanted to but that's okay uh, I'm gonna go ahead and remove everything from the bathroom like everything that's on the counter the rug that's in there just remove everything so I'm not cleaning around things it makes it so much easier for me um, and then yeah that's what we're gonna do in the last portion of this video <laughs>
just for a while Trying to please everyone who's around me I've been putting on my fake smile Even though I'm wasting time I don't want to be trapped in a box Trying to be like the rest when I'm not I just want to go my own way Gonna let the past burn down Cause honestly don't wanna be Stuck in more in conversations with you With you Alright you guys, so the video is just about over. I hope you guys got a ton of cleaning motivation from this and you just enjoyed hanging out with me because I'm so grateful that you're here watching my videos and supporting my channel. I mean, also a huge thank you to Love Every again for sending over that play mat. We absolutely love it. So if you guys are looking for some age appropriate play kits or a play mat for your little ones, make sure you check out the links in my description box and um, check out Love Every because their product that I received is absolutely amazing and I'm sure their other products are just as good. Um, before you go, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and also hit that red subscribe button down below if you're new around here because I would love to have you join my little YouTube fam. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. I know I have to be somewhere else To be able to find myself Shouldn't be so complicated If I listen to my heart, I'm going